Hey guys, before starting this video, I just wanted to tell you that I'm hosting weekly giveaways. In order to join this giveaway, you basically need to subscribe to this channel, like this video and comment under this video and click in the first link in the description down below and follow the rules of that website to enter the giveaway. And if you want to get free iTunes and Google Play gift card, basically using my referral code down below in order to get free more iTunes and Google Play gift cards and from there you can get free by your own and using my referral code you can encourage me to do even more giveaways good luck hey what's going on everybody so guys are here with a new video of Clash Royale and in this video I'm going to show a battle deck or a strategy that I recommend everyone to use it after the new update so Basically the update is coming or the balance changes I should say it's basically the giant and the poison they are going to nerf those Finally, I think because everybody's using it. I've been using it and I really got to uh, Higher trophies fast so I get I got like 200 trophies in one day. So I think uh, I'm really sad to hear that they will nerf it But it's also better because you have the chance to get to a higher arena as well and we they will and they will buff uh, the uh, golems uh, the both golems they can affect the flying troops so that's amazing and the elixir collector will increase the coast and the they will decrease the uh, the uh, skeleton army coast as well so here is i think after the update we will have these improvements for the for these four in my hand at the moment so I think I would go ahead and try them out so I got a draw at the beginning I played one time by myself and now let's see if I, I can win this time okay so here is now yeah it's already started so I already started the, the gameplay as you can see in here okay so I really like the golem as you all know so I think I think letting the golem affect flying troops that's really really amazing I really can't wait for it when will a 20 come so basically after two days or I believe after uploading this video will be one day left so yeah okay so let's see now uh, let's see so basically I, st I still didn't use my uh, uh, my golem so he didn't know that I have golem unfortunately that Valkyrie is taking my skeleton army so let's see hopefully he won't when I'm 100 trophies away from the legendary arena so i really want to get back to legendary arena, which i really got there twice hopefully i can get back there all right so let's wait probably now i'll wait for the golem so let me wait for eight elixirs and let me just wait okay it seems like the golem is ready so i'll not let the musketeer touch my tower instead to hit my golem Okay, so I still didn't hit my enemy, but hopefully I'll try my best because it's where he's really pushing really hard. Okay, it seems like maybe he's off. Oh, he put the barbarians. I thought he went offline. Anyway, so yeah, so here I got them. I damaged it and now I'm we are almost draw. Okay, I dealt more damage than him. And he has the baby dragon, so gladly he didn't put the Valkyrie. Now I think I can put the Skeleton Army to distract that Prince. So I think the best card to take down the Prince or that can counter it is basically Skeleton Army, I believe. This is this is what I think. I don't know if you still use the Prince. I don't really, I don't really use the Prince at all. Uh, I don't, I don't know why. I just not, I'm not a fan of using it. Although in the beginning of the game, I really wanted it because I think it was the strongest uh, card that was there and for lower level since uh, the beginning where we didn't have any legendary card. Okay, we have almost 15 seconds to go and we have now 10 seconds it seems like it's draw so we will have over time now which is double elixir so extra 60 seconds we will see now and yeah it's the sudden it's the sudden death okay so we have so let's see what do you think Should, can i can i win so he's in his uh, the way he's thinking he wanted to take that tower down but i'll put this skeleton army so that he wants all right so I, w I wanted him really to not use to not keep spamming that uh, that picker 
Although I'm trying to spam as much as I can of the golem because it's the only way to protect my tower I believe. So by then he couldn't touch the left tower if you noticed right at the beginning. So this is before the buff that they will do. This is like if they did the if they did they let the uh, the golems affect flying troops although he's just using one and if they make the uh, skeleton army even cheaper i think i will do even better so i don't know what do you think about it so yeah it's again draw okay so i think this will be the best battle deck after the uh, after the balance changes so tell me what do you think that's the trade for this video guys don't forget to subscribe like and share for more goodbye and see you later guys